Canada can see tornadoes in September. Yesterday was an example. The tornado season, though, usually peaks in July. Well, yesterday there were strong storms, stronger than normal storms that moved across Ontario. This is the tornado alley in this part of Ontario. These are all areas that are prone to EF2 to EF5 storms. On average, Canada sees about 60 tornadoes each year. And we've got new information tonight that two tornadoes tracked across Ontario and Quebec. Why? Warm air, warm and humid air clashing with a cold front. The clashing of those air masses caused the strong storms and those storms to rotate. Now, two storms, two tornadoes moved across the area. And here's a look at the paths of those storms. So one moved from basically Kinburn towards Dunrobin into Gatineau. One around the Ottawa area, the Kinburn, Dunrobin, Gatineau storm at EF3, according to the assessment by Environment Canada. Those would be winds up to 265 kilometers per hour. The other storm winds up to 220 kilometers per hour. Now, crews from Environment Canada were assessing the damage, the pattern of the damage, how badly damaged certain structures were. That's how you determine uh, how bad these storms were or how quick they were in terms of their speed, their track, and how strong the winds were. And you can see here on the Enhanced Fujita scale uh, what an EF2 and EF3 storm is. Severe damage and a rare EF3 storm, Robin, for September.